Okay, this is the last one for today's because I'm sure you're tired of seeing the same shirt. This is the multi-strand chain bib necklace. Um, now this one's really cool, I think, because it actually does fan out like a bib. And I just think that's really neat. Now, you can't really... Let me show you show you here that there's a little bit of detail in on this necklace. If you can see, there are little beads. And it's actually fairly intricately detailed. What they did is there's there are actually a bunch of different chains. There's a bunch of different chains in this necklace, so you got a lot of variety. And they all kind of blend together and bunch up, and it makes it, it actually is a pretty cool effect. Um, it's also got this clasp here. Anything with a clasp like this, like the short side long layered, have you gotten one yet? <laughs> They're going to be gone soon. Um, anything with a clasp like this, you're supposed to wear it to the side to accentuate the clasp. And I think that's real interesting. I like that. I think it's kind of innovative. And as you can see, the um, clasp itself is decorated with gems. Now this is about 25 inches long. Um, you know, it's antique silver plated, so I don't think it's sterling. And it's part of the Essentials collection. You know, I've got a lot of the Essentials collection because, you know, they're Essentials. And you wear it like this, and you fan out the bib. Now it's, it's really interesting, I gotta say. I like this one a lot. I think it would look great with, like, a tank top, maybe. Um, a black tank top to wear the silver with it and sort of just accentuate. Um, I think it would always look good with a white tee. Everything looks good with a white tee. I wouldn't wear this to black tie events. I don't think this is one of the more dressy pieces unless you're wearing a more sort of punk outfit. Like maybe if you're wearing a sort of alternatively cut black dress, this might look good with it. But I, I say that this is probably a little more casual or, um, you know, not very black tie, but maybe semi-formal you could probably get away with. Um, it's a good piece. It's $88. Um, the only thing is that that I don't like about this necklace is that the stuff tends to get tangled as you can see me taking it on and off the hooks they'll get they'll all get tangled together and um, it's it's not that hard to fix I mean you can see it's like coming out already but it is a little bit annoying when you want to take it on or take it off or if you're walking around and you know the the necklace is bouncing a little it's going to get tangled and you can't do like you can do with the short side long layered because this is asymmetrical too you can't just go like this and go like that like you can with the short side long layer because then it'll just get bunched up you actually have to sit and um, take the time to iron it out or shake it a little and, and hope it goes back into place instead of making it worse like I just did uh, I have to say that's probably the biggest drawback of this but it's still a really neat piece you know like I said and I I think chains are really cool you know originally obviously they were made for tools and now we're making them into jewelry and I like the trend I really do Anyway, that is the last review for today. You can, as always, get from my boutique. Link in the description. Thank you for watching, and let me know if you have any questions. And if there's anything in particular you want me to review next, just leave me a comment, and if I have it, I will get to it. All right, thanks.